Zhu managed to quench its thirst for vengeance at Yi Ling, dealing Wu a crippling blow from which it would never recover. Meanwhile, Cao Cao, fearing that Xu would soon grow too powerful to stop, mobilized a large force to engage the Xu army at Jie Ting. The general of Jie Ting, Ma Su, set up his camp high on the mountaintop in order to meet the Wei offensive, while the main Xu army mobilized to reinforce him. The final confrontation between Xu and Wei was at hand. Ma Chao, sensing the importance of this moment, rode once more into battle. Can a world where people act in anger be considered one of virtue? To take vengeance, just to have vengeance taken again from another. The justice that I seek is not to be found here. I see you are still suffering from the discord born from Yi Ling. I am in Lord Liu Bei's debt. Cao Cao must die. Seize control of this area before the main enemy army arrives. All forces, begin the attack! The base of the mountain has been overrun. We have been isolated. Do not fear, Master Masu. My sword will clear a path through the enemy to you. Hang in there for a while longer. Name 
of justice. Masu should be able to hold out until the main army arrives. I'll show you something! Justice! Do not give in, brothers! Go! 
you saved us. Thank you. Everyone, fall back to the fortress at the base of the mountain. Justice!
I will cut you down. Feet. I will have to adapt my tactics to keep up. We must rouse ourselves for this fight! Since the Battle of Tongit, I have fought endlessly. Here is Finally bring an end to your tyranny! I fight in the name of justice! What happened to the rage that you displayed at Town Gate? I gave up that anger. Hmm. Yet despite that, you would still kill me. This isn't for revenge. It's for my own sense of closure. This is a good horse. I'll take it. Yeah, he can really run and is worth the price. Will this be enough? I can't take this. It wouldn't be fair. Even if I put this on display, 
It'll sell. Then keep it somewhere in back. Wait a second. Are you much? Yeah. 